Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. I don't think that sound advice. Oh, and who are you? Oh, you just look fantastic. Hey! Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Kara, the gamer around here. And today, we're continuing with Mass Effect. Oh my god! This is part two of our Mass Effect gameplay, and if you want to see me getting overwhelmed at the prologue and the tutorial, go and watch the other video, and I'll meet you back here. For those that went on that journey with me, let's have a quick recap, shall we? One, we know that there are humans and Turians. They're not friends, typically. However, one was on board called Nihilus, and he was a mate. We went off on a mission because we saw a giant space fly thing that looked like a hand. We lost a girly already in his hometown, Eden Prime, and it will never be the same again. And then our mate Nihilus, the Turian, met another Turian, who was wasn't so nice and actually shot him in the back and his name is Sauron and he is the baddie he is a bad guy so I believe we're going to have to go and track him down now we also got shocked by a giant beacon thing we had some weird flashbacks and then we woke up in the ship and we left off going back to find Joker oh I also found out that the two main girlies that's gonna be Jane Shepard and our girly Ashley they actually voice the hex girls in Scooby-Doo which just makes me love them even more so I can't wait to get back into this some things I want to say before I jump back in I turned on squad power usage to all as per recommendations of you guys it was currently on defensive in the prologue and I also turned on auto level up because I I haven't quite got to grips with it yet so I'm gonna let the game do its thing I'll work out how it starts to use it and then hopefully I can go aha and then I can make the squad my own I also had some comments that I shouldn't have jumped in straight with Jane I could have created a new ID and created a whole class but I don't really know what the classes are um, and I'm quite happy with Jane being my first girlie in my first playthrough. But for now, Jane will carry me through this mission, and I'm happy to have her. So without further ado, let's get gaming. All right, let's see back where we were. We, we are on the ship, and I believe we have to find Joker, so let's go and do that. Let's go and do that real quick. I've also adjusted some of the audio levels here. Oh, Thinking you, I can replenish my medi gel. Doing that immediately. Thank you so much. <gasps> Cadence here. Glad to see you're okay, Commander. Kay. Commander, I'm glad to see you're okay. Losing Jenkins was hard on the crew, and I'm glad we didn't lose you too. Um, Jenkins will be missed. Yeah, I wish I could have done something to save him. Oh. I was there. You did everything right. It was just bad luck. He did run ahead, to be fair. It's been a hell of a shakedown, Cruz. Our first mission ends with one Spectre killing another. The Citadel Council's not going to be happy about that. Probably use it to lever more concessions out of the Alliance. Hmm, seems like you've been around. You've got a good grasp of the situation. You a career man? Yeah, a lot of biotics are. We're not restricted, but we sure don't go undocumented. May as well get a paycheck for it. Mm. Besides, my father served. I made him proud when I enlisted. Oh, yeah. Eventually. But is that why you're here? Because of your family? I'm in it for the action, dude. Couldn't keep me out if you tried. Best way to explore the galaxy is behind a cannon. Oh, yeah. Is that how you got here? I heard about a coos. I bet you had your pick of posts after that. Word is we're heading for the Citadel, ma'am. Can you, uh, tell me why? Um, why don't you just follow your orders, dude? If the captain thought you needed to know, he'd tell you. Yes, ma'am. Sorry. Whatever happens, we'll be ready, Commander. Now, I don't want to get feisty on Kaiden like that, but darling. Darling, don't be so nosy, okay? Oh my god, Ash. Oh my god, my. Oh. <gasps> All my characters are here. Let me talk to the doctor because I love her voice. Yes, Commander? Is there something you need? Investigate. Personal questions. How did you end up <laughs> serving on an Alliance ship? Straight I into it. right out of med school. Earth always seemed boring to me. Too safe, too secure. I figured the colonies were teeming with exotic adventure. Mm. I wanted to travel the stars, tending the wounds of tough soldiers with piercing eyes and sensitive souls. <laughs> Turns out military life isn't quite as romantic as I'd imagined. Aww. But humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through the Traverse. And the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. Any regrets? Ever think you made the wrong choice? Sometimes I think about opening a private practice back on Earth. Ooh. Or maybe taking a position at one of the new med centers out in the colonies. But there's something special about working on soldiers. If I left the Alliance now, I'd feel like I was abandoning them. 
investigate. Let me let me ask about Kaiden. Oh, can I? Kaiden Elenko. That's a beautiful name. How well do you know the lieutenant? I'd never worked with him before this mission, but he has an impressive service record. Over a dozen special commendations. Wow. Tends to keep to himself, though. Maybe because of the headaches. It's not easy being an L2. An L2? What does that have to do with it? Well, most biotics now use the L3 implants. Lieutenant Alenko was wired with the old L2 configuration. Oh, it's vintage. Sometimes there are complications. Complications? Uh, we should be aware of this? What kind of complications? Severe mental disabilities, insanity, crippling physical pain. There's a long list of horrific side effects. Caden's lucky. He just gets migraines. <laughs> right. Okay. All right. Let me... How did you end up serving on an alliance Yeah, ship? let me ask more personal I enlisted questions. right out of med school. Oh, I already asked this. I wanted to travel the stars, tending... But humanity needs the Alliance if we want to keep expanding through okay, the Okay, investigate. And the Alliance always needs good doctors. So I stayed on to do my part. I already asked you that, What do you know about Captain Anderson? Yes, here we go. I've served with him for a few tours now. He knows when to let things slide and when to crack the whip. That's gonna be me. The crew knows he's seen pretty much anything That's gonna be me. Into. And he cares about the people under his command. Okay. I Goodbye. Should go. Goodbye, Commander. Goodbye, Commander. Okay, let me talk to my gyal, Ashley. Hey! I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Guys, this is two hex girls talking to each other. Do you even know that dude? These are two hex girls. I'm a hex girl. Um, he'll be missed. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. If Jenkins was still alive, I might not be here. Damn, soldiers die. That is rough. Hey, might choose it though. Hey, choosing it, savage. When your number comes up, it's over. His did. Do you really believe that, Commander? After what happened to you on a coos? Are you saying you only survived because of random chance? That wasn't luck, darling. That wasn't luck, darling. I've got skill. Hey, that was not luck. I survived because I refused to die. Tell him. With respect, sir. I think you had somebody watching over you. With respect, I think not. How are Things are pretty up? rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before comes with being a marine but to see my whole unit wiped out and you never get used to seeing dead civilians mm. but things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up did she help did she, she did actually help me she did help because she helped me she helped kill the people while I was defusing the bombs we couldn't have done it without you Williams yeah thanks commander I have to admit I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy well it's nice when someone makes you feel welcome. Don't disappoint me! And that's on that. Everyone on this ship has to do his or her part, Williams. Remember that. Understood, ma'am. Yes! Oh, you keep these people in line, will you, Jane? Oh, Jane! Jane is not to be messed with, please! Oh, I feel it. I feel it in my bones. I'm so sassy. Oh, I'm sassy. Hey! What's going on here? Hey! What are you talking about? We need to find Joker, babes. Where is he? Hey, trying to find Joker. Have you seen Joker anywhere? Is he through here? Captain Anderson. Oh my god, Andy! Hi! Go speak to Joker when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Normandy into dock. Right. Is that all you said to me? Go speak to Joker when you're ready. Tell him to bring the Normandy into dock. Hey, so where is Joker? Hey! So where is my girly Joker? Because he's literally not in here. Oh, is he through that door? Whoa! There's an elevator there. Do I have to go through that, maybe? Yeah, we came through that door, right? Hey, guys, going up the elevator. Going in the elevator. Activate. Yes, come on. The only way is up, baby. You and I. Da, 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 da. Hello? <gasps> In the Normandy's vehicle bay, using a squad member's locker allows you to assign equipment to them. New equipment may be purchased from the requisition officer. What the frick is even that? Hey! In the Normandy vehicle bay, using a squad member's locker allows you to assign equipment to them. Oh, what, like we do, can we do in the menu? Hello, hello, Alliance requisition officer. Hey, Commander. Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? Yes, what have you got? What have you got? Whatever you want. 
Armor, weapons, mods? It's not standard Alliance issue, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. I'm fitting a mod. Well, as long as you don't mind paying for it. Pay you? Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? Yeah. My stuff doesn't come from the Alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's mm. not cheap. Hell, the mm. licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. Show me. Let's see what you got. You bet, Commander. Oh, -ho! here we go, gang. Now, how much moolah have I got? I've got a whole 1,400 pounds. That's what I've got. And these are going to be costing 25 grand. Okay, we're not going for that. Oh, hello, but this is 200 pounds. Hey, this is going to be 200 moolahs. So I actually could do this. What is that? Grenade upgrade? A grenade upgrade. That sounds weird. And a medigel upgrade. Increases maximum units of medigel by one. I actually haven't had to use my medigel apart from in the tutorial once. So, don't need a grenade upgrade because I don't use them. Should I do this? Maybe. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Hey, guess what? Buying that. Okay, I might need it eventually. Should I buy all of them? Ugh, I'm unsure. Sod it. I'll just buy them. Hey, guys, buying them. Okay, I've done it now. I spent my moolah. Hello, hello. This is a very cool thing. An M35 Mako. Wow. Okay, let's look in our codex. This is giving me some things. Oh my lordy, Lil. Oh ho ho. Uh oh. Com kinetic combat hard suits use a dual layer system wow, to protect what is the that? wearer. The inner layer consists of fabric armor with kinetic padding. Areas that don't need to be flexible, such as the chest or shins, are reinforced with sheets of lightweight, ablative ceramic. Okay. The outer layer consists of automatically generated kinetic barriers. Objects traveling above a certain speed will trigger the barrier's reflex system and be deflected, provided there oh, is nice. enough energy left in the shield's power cell. Right. Armored hard suits are sealable to protect the wearer from Should extremes kind of, of temperature and atmosphere. Standard equipment includes an onboard mini frame and a communications, navigation, and sensing suite. The a mini suite? frame is designed to accept and display data from a weapon's smart targeting system to make it easier to locate and eliminate enemies. Guys, do you not think these look like grunts? That's very cute. I enjoy that a lot. Okay, now I want Combat. to see. No, 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 no. Biotics. Guys, there's a lot here. There's a lot here. Oh, oh no, oh no, there's a lot here. Do you guys want me to read, play these when I play these games? Let me know. Because there's Bio. a lot here. Bio. Okay. Now, I wanted to see this. Ships and vehicles. The here we go. infantry fighting vehicle was designed go. for the System Alliance's frigates. Though the interior is cramped, an M35 is small enough to be carried in the cargo bay and easily deployed on virtually any world. That's what we're in With now, With its I think. turreted 155 mm mass accelerator and coaxially mounted machine gun, the Mako can provide a fire team with weapons support as well as mobility. Oh, hell Since yeah. Alliance Marines may be required to fight on any world, the Mako is environmentally sealed and equipped with micro thrusters for use on oh God, gravity got planetoids. It has nose, dude. The Mako is powered by a sealed hydrogen oxygen fuel cell and includes a small element zero core. While yes. not large enough to nullify the vehicle's mass, the core can reduce it enough to be safely airdropped. When used in conjunction with thrusters, it also allows the Mako to extricate itself from difficult terrain. <sighs> When used in conjunction with thrusters, what do you mean? What does that mean? Can it fly? No, it can't fly. I think it can just nose it out of a, itself out of a situation. Also, loving this voice actor, by the way, beautifully, beautifully, beautifully described there. Thank you so much. Okay, journal. Am I still in the? Pro I'm still in the prologue. Oh, guys, I'm still in the prologue. <laughs> I thought I finished the prologue. Oh, oh, oh. Wait, where was that? Ashley's locker. Oh, here we go. I see, I see, I see. I see, I see. Rightio. I want you to be accurate. Here's the thing. I did all of this last time. So. Yeah. Yeah, that's actually quite a lot different. Wait, that's actually very worth putting on, isn't it? You have that, my darling. 
Um, none of these. None of these. If you could set this to... Oh, you can sort it by level. Look at that. Oh, yes, there were some things like... Yeah, like this. I can't put on and I don't know why. That's because I'm too low level, I guess. Right? Kaiden. Now, let me go to that shotgun because... Yeah, okay, you can only apply these once to your characters. Interesting. Why is there one, two, three, four more lockers? Is this gonna be my squad? Can I have four more people on my on my team? Oh girly! Oh wow wow. That's ultimately a lot better. Where's my locker? Because I would like to upgrade myself. Wow, look at all of these. Oh, I can just do that in my menu. I don't need to- I don't need to go into a locker for that. Okay. Where is Joker? Where is Joker? He's not in here, is he? No. Ooh, what is that? Hey! What is that noise? Oh my gosh, here we go. Here we go. And here we go, gang. And I found something. I found Engineer Adams. Would you look at that? Sure hey! Jenkins, Commander. Oh, yes, it is. It is. It's terrible. It's actually very sad. So anyway, have you seen Joker? What's this? Field Integrity Monitor. Examine. Oh, I picked some stuff up in the codex about it. Okay. Okay. All right. Wow. Wow, 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 gang. Okay. Heading forth. And I'm heading forth. Well, can I go down here? What's down here? Hey! Nothing. Where on earth is Joker? I lost him. Oh, I lost Joker. Going up. Going back up. I'm going back up because I can't find him. Hmm. I wonder why. Why can't I find him? Hello. We're going up here. Oh, going up here. Hopefully, this wasn't the same place where I just was. Oh. <gasps> Whoa! I found people! And I have found people! Whoa! Look at all of these things. Look at all of these things! Examine, I'll pick that up. Navigator Presley and hello! I'm glad you're okay, Commander. Losing Jenkins was hard enough on the crew. Oh, guys, I really miss him! I feel sad! Oh, wait, 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 wait! This is where Joker is! Yes, I remember! This is where we started the mission! Hey, dude! Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. Hey, girly! Guys, we found Joker. It's okay. We're gamers, dude. Seriously. There's a loading screen. <gasps> now, the Normandy is what we're on, right? We're on that. That's a nice looking ship. Hey. hey that's a nice looking ship, gang. Ascension, flagship of the Citadel fleet. Well, size isn't everything. Why so touchy, Joker? I'm just saying you need firepower, too. Wow, look at that. Look at that monster. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side, then. Oh, it's, it's all friend. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy, requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Woo! Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Normandy out. Normandy, this is Alliance Tower. Please proceed to Dock 422. Dock 422? How many is there? Wow, look at this! Look at this, how it looks this tremendous. This is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Seren? 
You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action. <laughs> you don't get to make demands of a council ambassador. He is not nice. Citadel security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Who were they? Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with you. Cool just the voice. ground team from Eden Prime. In case you had any questions. <laughs> I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? They are. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They council. were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Well, they're blind. I'm not gonna sit on my ass just because the Council doesn't want to do anything. If they won't stop Saren, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. What? The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That wasn't That's our fault. Saren's fault, not hers. He ran off. Then Nihilus we ran better off. hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. Yes, Penthouse Sweet. Come on, will you? And that's why I hate politicians. Ashley. Important locations are marked on your map. Open the mission computer to access it. Hey, on my map. Oh, my lordy Lou dude. What the frick is going on here? Vehicle store, destination, squad member, plot, mineral. Mineral? Why are we collecting minerals? Point of interest. Oh, hey, that's right where... That's Avena, apparently. And there's a, an anomaly, debris, surveyed, and transition. I'm guessing that's like an elevator. Yes? Oh, wow. Hey, gang, we've got some points of interest on this map, so let's go to them, shall we? This is us here. We're going to go to Avena. Okay, set destination. Seriously, will you? Seriously, will you? Follow the pulsating arrow on your radar to get to Citadel. Yes, 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 yes. Yes! Hey! Big place. It is a big place, yeah. Ashley, what do you got to say, my darling? Nothing? Fine. That's okay. You don't actually have to say anything. Okay, heading this way. Wow, guys, it's big. This, this place is big, actually. Heading this way. Can we go in here? Yes! Oh my god, we're approaching the destination, dude! Avina, we found out! Look at this video! Allow me to be your guide. Hello! Greetings, and welcome to the Presidium. My name is Avina, and I am pleased to be your virtual guide throughout this level of the Citadel Space Station. <laughs> no thanks! Um, are you real? So are you a person or a program? I am a fully interactive virtual intelligence yeah. programmed to provide spontaneous guidance at predetermined locations of it's interest bot, throughout this level of the Citadel. I may also be contacted through any of the Presidium VI terminals, should you require assistance. Not interested. I'll pass. <laughs> I apologize if you found my service unsatisfactory. Please submit any complaints in writing to the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board. Have Guess what? Nice I like to talk to a human. <laughs> Directions. The elevator to Cezac Academy is located down the ramp to the to your left. Lovely. So who needs a guide? We have these signs. The Alliance docking bay can be found there. Now is that where we need to go? What do we do? Uh, journal. Expose Saren. Go to the tower. Go to the Citadel Tower on the Presidium. For an audience with the Oh my god, we're actually going to talk to the council today? <laughs> Well, I don't need to go there, do I? I need to go to the tower. Where's the tower? Map. Map dude looking on my tower. I mean, looking for a tower on my map. <laughs> What's that? Oh, that's another Avena. Damn it. They're all Avenas. Oh, Citadel Tower. Here we go. Here we go. So I need to go all the way down here. I, I'm going here. Right? I think that's right. Guys, there's much to explore here, actually. Okay, heading this way. <gasps> oh! Use Citadel Rapid Transit to travel quickly between major locations. As you explore the Citadel, more locations will unlock. Travel! 
Obsidian locations. Let's see where we can go. Guys, look at this! Speed run! Pew pew! You can get the train now, dude. Okay, it's not that deep. This is a different loading screen. <gasps> We're here! Hey! What are those cherry trees? I don't know, babes. You sure have to climb a lot of stairs to reach the council. I think that's supposed to be symbolic of their important. Saren's hiding These something. Look like Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council. Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. We've heard of Garrus. Why? That name rings a bell. Hello. Wow, cool glasses. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Who was that? Who were you just talking to? That was Executor Palin, head of Citadel Security, my boss. Mm. He'll be presenting my findings on Saren to the Council. You don't like Saren? Sounds like you really want to bring him down. I don't trust him. Something about him rubs me the wrong way. But he's a spectre. Everything he touches is classified. I can't find any hard evidence. Down. I think the Council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. Maybe. Wait, so he's a Turian as well? But he's nice. Okay. Fantastic water feature there, may I just say. Splendid. Are you enjoying that? Hey, you enjoy that. Hey! So, hey everyone. Wow, what are- What are all these beings? You look- I'm a juicy. You look fantastic. You're not Ashley. I bet all these staircases aren't just for show. They make for good defensive positions if this place is ever- attacked. Well, that's true. I did not think of that. Lots of stairs do make good defensive positions. You're not wrong, dude. Well, aren't you majestic? Hey, sir. So, hey. Don't be ridiculous. The Volus won't be joining the council for years. I'm not so sure. The humans are making a strong push, and you can bet the Volus will be right on their coattails if they succeed. Coattails? Allowing the humans to join us is a sound strategic move. <laughs> but the Volus? No. The Hanna are likely to be next, then the Elcor. You may be right. Though the Hanar need to lighten up a bit first. Who's the Hanar? You just don't like them because you have Who is the ha What is this? Oh, and who are you? Oh, you just look fantastic. Hey! Hey! Oh my god, he looks like the dude from Monsters Inc. Who's the big who's the big Spider-Man? <laughs> you look like the little cousin. Okay, sweet. That is a that's a rapid transit situation. Dress is lovely. That purple is really your colour. Okay, I'm moving forward. I'm going up the stairs. I'm going to keep moving up the stairs. Oh, yes. We're, hey, guys, we're heading up to a right place. Here we go. Heading up, heading up. Oh, Andy's here. The hearing's already started. Come on. Andy, what are you doing here, you sausage? Okay, heading up. Sure the Geth well. attack is a matter of some concern, but there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. She's very the pretty. investigation by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've mm -hmm. read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus <gasps> was a fellow Spectre and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson, you always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges He's against there? me. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. That was you, not me. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift actually, the that blame was us, wasn't cover it? your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. <laughs> I think that actually was us. Well. Oops. But what can you expect <laughs> from a human? Uh, you'll pay. You can expect me to kill you the next time we meet. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. You're a loser. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. Tell Shepard's him. admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. The humans are wasting your time, Counselor. And mine. I can swear at him. <sighs> I will say this, though. I'm actually going to say it. I'm going to swear at him. Because he killed our mate Nihilus. You can't hide behind the Council forever. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? Mm. I agree. 
Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? What's the point? You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. Yep. <laughs> the Council has found no evidence of any Tell connection us. between Something. Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. That mate! Was there a different way that could have gone? This meeting is adjourned. No, because it would have been the end of the game too soon. Oh, my mate. Tevos and... No, Tevos is a girl. Who's that? Udina. Oh, I'm sorry, mate. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every oh, colony we have is history. at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. How do you know Saren? Yeah. Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. I'm it. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. Now what? What's our next step? As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. Why don't we become a Spectre and then we what can about Garrus, get him? What about Garrus, investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. I'll talk to him. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. User? I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. <sighs> I don't like this. You can't just cut Captain Anderson out of this investigation. The Ambassador's right. I need to step aside. I need to take care of some business. Captain, meet me in my office later. He speaks very satisfyingly. Harkin's probably getting drunk at Cora's Den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Any other leads? Maybe there's another way Let's to get find some info here, Garen. Saren. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. And there it is. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. I've heard Barla Vaughn's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. What about you and Saren? You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago. Here we go. I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Okay. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience, no hesitation. A savage. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. <laughs> I was just about to say, so would I. Because we're a bit savage here. But we wouldn't kill innocent people. He's a monster. Killing innocents doesn't end wars. Yeah, it causes tell them. Tell them, tell them, tell them, tell them. I know how the world works, Commander. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. So would I. Sometimes a thousand people must die so a million can live. That's not what I meant. But only if there's no other way. That's not what I meant. <laughs> Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows oh. how to cover his tracks. Oh, 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 okay. You can see each I of the... Go. Okay. Good luck, Shepard. That I'll wasn't clear. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. I thought it meant, like, if I killed Saren, I could cover my tracks. That's why I said, so would I. And it was for the same bit of dialogue. Guys, this is just fantastic. What are you doing to that piece of... that piece of metal? So, this is where the council passes judgment on all us little folk, huh? Yes. The feeling ran over our heads, no, I don't, Ashley, and I would appreciate if you didn't speak to me like that, thank you. I am actually the commander here. Do you even know me? Hey, I'm actually going to be the commander of this. Ooh. Okay, now what? Journal. 
Oh my god. Oh my god. There's so many things to do. Let's go and see Balavon. Hey, gang. Heading to see Balavon. Where the heck? Okay, let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Going back down the stairs. Balavon is not on this map. Heading down. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Seriously. Oh, I can fast travel. Hey, fast traveling immediately. La, la, la. Yes. Traveling. Oh, where did they say Balavon was? I'm going back here. We can always fast travel somewhere else. Zoom, 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 zoom. Hello. Okay, we're now at the Presidium Embassies. Okay, map. What's on here now? That's going to be a Vena. Huh? Bank. Yes, here is Balavon. Okay. And here is Balavon. Okay, let's walk around. I think we have to unlock more places to walk, so... That's fine. Okay, heading this way. Wow, look at this person's legs. Incredible. They're like half alien, half horse. Doo -doo -doo. Guys, the graphics are really nice here. Wow, look at that statue. Oh, it's the body armor, but it looks like a giant grunt. It looks like a grunt mixed with Bioshock. That's what that looks like. The big daddies. The big daddies indeed. Okay, watch this. Welcome to the Presidium. Welcome to the Presidium. Welcome. <laughs> Guys, look at them doing all the work. Whoa, look at this here. Look at this here. Can you tell me about this? Welcome to Presidium Tourism Welcome. Terminal 3. Here in the financial district, a the statue you see before you here we go. was commissioned to honor the Krogan soldiers who gave their lives to protect Citadel space during the Rachni Wars. Here we go. In the aftermath of the Krogan rebellions, several embassies petitioned to have the statue removed. However, this motion was eventually quashed by the Council. Investigate. Krogan rebellions. Why did the Council fight so oh, hard damn. to keep the statue? That's thing. The Krogan were instrumental in saving the galaxy from the Rachni threat. The Council believed this historical fact should not be forgotten. Hmm. The Council also hoped that preserving the memorial would improve diplomatic relations with the Krogan and bring about a peaceful resolution to the rebellions. Unfortunately, yes. the Krogan refused to negotiate and only surrendered after their population and homeworlds had been ravaged by the Turians. Brilliant. What were the Rachni what were the Wars? Wars? Rachni Wars. Nearly 2200 years ago, explorers seeking to expand Citadel space opened up mass relays leading to systems controlled by the Rachni. A highly intelligent and aggressive insect race, oh, the insects. Rachni unleashed a war of conquest against the rest of the galaxy that lasted for nearly three centuries. It's a long time. The emergence of the Krogan finally turned the tide in favor of the Citadel species. Krogan forces provided the numbers necessary to halt the Rachni advance and drive them back. The Krogan then pursued their retreating fleets. Able to survive the harsh environments of the Rachni homeworlds, the Krogan hunted their enemy to extinction. That's a little extreme. Was it really necessary to wipe them out? I am sorry, but a value <laughs> judgment of that nature goes beyond Typical. my programming. Log That's off. all for now. All right, thank dude. Thank you for using Avena. No, thank have you. Have a pleasant day. No, thank you. Hey, guess what, Avena? You have a pleasant day. How's about that? Okay, right back at you. Now, who is this? Hey, so who's this? Hey. Ah, human. This one is greatly pleased to see you here in my decadent emporium. Personal question. Who are you? <laughs> this one's face name is Delaninder, though many in this place simply refer to it as Delan. Delan! Please take time to examine the fine goods it has for purchase, all of great worth. I'd like to buy something. Show me your items. Oh, this one is pleased to do so, human. You will not be disappointed. View upgrades. <laughs> okay. What do these do? Guys, and here's the thing. I don't know if to spend my moolah early. Maybe I should not. But I probably will. I'm really bad at spending money in games and getting upgrades and stuff like this, so... Maybe I should. Anti-personal rounds. Two. 
Designed to shred flesh and other organic matter, these rounds are particularly effective against living targets. Do I have them already? Or is that on a suit? I don't know what this is for. Motorized joints. Oh, ammo upgrade, armor upgrade. Uh, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. Instead of projectiles, upgraded weapons release charged particle bolts that can bypass kinetic barrier shields. However, the actual damage done to the target is simply less than what's done by a standard round. That's going to be a plasma pistol. This is what his, this is, is going to be. It will get rid of the shield, but it won't damage them. All right. Mechanical augmentation increases the brute strength of the wearer, allowing them to deliver powerful blows when rifle butting or pistol whipping opponents. And you know I enjoy a melee, okay? I think I like this one though, but that is going to be $700. That is a lot. That's a lot of monies, dude. I'm buying it. Buying. I bought it. That might have been a mistake, but I bought it. Hey guys, we came to the town and went shopping! Yay! Guys, I spent my Christmas money. I spent my Christmas money. Hey! Oh, here we go, Barlavon. What's this? <gasps> One of the Earth Clan. They're in the suit! Ah, a very famous one, yes? You are the one called Shepherd. Hello. The tale of how you survived the great tragedy on Akuz is truly remarkable. Thank you. I am amazed each time I hear it. Are you spying on me? I don't like strangers keeping tabs on me. I mean, fair. Forgive me, Earth Clan. My name is Barla Vaughn. My job makes it necessary for me to keep informed. Hmm. I am a financial advisor to many important clients here on the Citadel. When someone as important as yourself arrives on the station, I take notice. I need... I, I need information. I heard you work for the Shadow Broker. Yeah. Do you have any information about Saren? You're very blunt, Shepard. But you're right. I am an agent for the Shadow Broker. And I do know something about Saren. Can we make a deal? I hear your information can be expensive. Let's be nice to him a little bit. Normally, this information bit. would cost a small fortune. But these are exceptional circumstances. Yes! So I am going to give it to you for free. Love a bargain. What's the catch? No. There is no catch. See? The Shadow Broker is Actually. quite upset with Saren right now. They used to do a lot of business until Saren turned on him. What a shock. Saren betrayed him. Imagine that. Mm-hmm. No matter what you think of Saren, he's not stupid. He knows the Shadow Broker is a valuable ally. Turning on him doesn't make sense. Not unless something huge was at stake. Okay. I don't know the details, but the Shadow Broker hired a freelancer to deal with it. A Krogan mercenary. Anything else? That's not much to go on. I just told you that the most famous <laughs> specter in the galaxy betrayed the Shadow Broker. Quite a bargain. Considering the price. Speak hey, with the Krogan if you want to learn more. I heard he was paying a visit to Citadel Security. If you hurry, you might catch him before he leaves the Academy. Why is he there? Isn't it strange that a Krogan would want to speak with c -Sec? Very. However, I doubt the visit was entirely his choice. You'll need to speak with him if you want to know more. Investigate Shadow Broker. Uh, personal question. Hey, Balavon, tell me more about your job. <laughs> Galactic finance is incredibly complex. A mix of laws and regulations from dozens of interstellar economies. I'm an expert in how all these economies interact. <sighs> For a fee, no. I share my expertise. I don't have any moolah, dude. No. I also offer premium services for those clients who need someone to conduct business without drawing unwanted attention. Discreet and efficient. That's my motto. This is legal. Sounds pretty shady. Everything I do falls completely within the bounds of interstellar <laughs> commerce law. Does it? Even so, many of my clients would prefer their transactions remain undisclosed. Oh, who is he talking to then? For example, suppose a Hanar ambassador was petitioning the council to reduce tariffs on Hanar goods. How would it look if he had money invested in a Hanar exporting company? Even if his true motives were to help his people, he would be accused of advancing the petition for his own personal gain. I can keep his personal finances private. 
Investigate the Shadow Tell Broker. Tell me more about the Shadow Broker. Most people think I deal in finances, but my real currency is knowledge. Okay. I trade information. Hey, that was a lie. It has made me very wealthy. But the Shadow Broker is the true master. Every day he buys and sells secrets that could topple governments, always giving them to the highest bidder. Okay. Yet somehow he never seems to upset the natural balance of power. All those secrets being passed around seem to even out. Nobody ends up with an advantage in the end. I should go. I'm gonna go. Goodbye, Commander. We have enough from him. And Barlavon, I didn't like your tone with me at one point then. Just gonna say that, okay? Right, directions. Right. Now I don't want to go and see Shadow Broker, so where the hell is that? Hey, Shadow Broker! Are you on this map? Oh, you're not. Or Lordy Luga. Okay. Journal. Rex. He's at the CSEC Academy. Where is the CSEC Academy? Can I get a transit? Let me see. Hey. What's a ward location? Cora's Den. I don't know what that is, but I'm gonna go there. I'm going there. Oh, I hope I can get back. A gentleman's club? This is Cora's Den. What the hell? That's her. Ooh! What? Oh, I think not. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. What is happening? What is happening? Actually, this sniper sucks. Sorry. This sniper is truly awful. How do I change weapons again? Here, like this. Uh, what's that? Shotgun? I switch into that. <gasps> no! Yes! Oh my god, I leveled up. <laughs> Guys, I'm doing the shotty. Down. My shield! Oh, my shield is on! Those were Saren's men. Oh my god, oh my god. Area secured. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, what is this place? Oh my god, there's dancers, dude. <laughs> hey! You think it's expensive to live here? I don't know. Not really my kind of place, but there sure are some spectacular views here. Cardin, keep your hands and your eyes to yourself, alright? Seriously. Hello! Hey! So I don't know why I'm here. Why am I here? Hey, Harkin! Oh my god, sit down! A million light years from where humanity began, and we walk into a bar filled with men drooling over half naked women, shaking their asses on a stage. I decide if that's funny or sad. Yes. What? You don't think they're here because of the food? Wait, how do I put my weapon away? I forgot. Like that. Oh no! No, no, no! That's actually gonna be. How do I put my weapon away? I forgot. No. No. Huddle up! Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, gang. Did it! I did it! And I did it! Hello! Oh, Harkin's even here. You're not even Harkin. That's embarrassing. I'm so sorry. Okay, heading around here. Hey, everyone, what are you drinking? Hey! Hey, lovely place you've got here. Hello, Harkin. Hey there, sweetheart. You looking for some fun? Because I gotta say, that soldier get up looks oh, I'm gonna real eat him good alive. on that body of yours. Give me something good to say. Why your sweet little ass down <laughs> side, old Harkin? Have a drink. See where this goes. You're disgusting. I'd rather drink a cup of acid after chewing on a razor blade. That <laughs> with my feelings. You gotta do better than that. After 20 years with CSEC, I've been called every name in the book. <sighs> Don't call me that. Call me princess again and you'll be picking your teeth up on the floor. <laughs> now tell me where Garrus is. Okay, okay, just relax. Yes, we Garrus, got him! You, say. <laughs> you must be one of Anderson's crew. Poor bastard still trying to bring Saren down, huh? Yes, I know we? where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something first. Did the captain let you in on his big secret? Don't waste my time. Just tell me where Garrus is before this gets ugly. But it's all related, don't you see? The captain used to be a specter. Didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush-hush. The first human ever given that honor. And then he blew it. Screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames Saren. Says the Turians set him up. 
Siren is a tu is a Turian, right? Uh, what went wrong? Why'd they kick him out? Have to ask him. I never heard any of the details. But it's a good story, though. The heroes fall. Classic tragedy. <laughs> How do you know this? He said they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. If you got them, you might as well spread them around. I don't think that's sound advice. Hey, 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 gang. Don't take that advice. Hey. Hey, maybe go to a clinic. Yeah. Oh, uh, disgusting. You're a pig. Just noticed that now, did you? That's not why I'm here. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side of the wards. Last I heard, he was going back there. Right. Not to Michael's office, going there I'm now. out of here. Yeah, good. Go. Let me drink in peace. And I will shoot you. Do you want that? Don't. It's not worth it. Hold me back! It's not worth it! Not now. I'm watching the show. Oh, I'm so, I'm so sorry. I did not see you there. Girly! I'm so sorry. I didn't know that was happening. Go away. I'm not interested in talking. Fair enough. And fair enough, to be honest. Do you know what I mean? I got business here, but not with you. I think you do, sweetie. Wow, look at all these people. We can watch. I don't want to watch you, even though you do deserve, even though you're working so hard, my darling. Hey, Jenna. Sorry, I'll get to you when I can. Oh, don't worry about it, sweetie. It's okay. I can't stay anyway. I've actually got to go. Okay. Captain Anderson, tell us he used to be a specter. Maybe it's not true. Harkin's an ass, but he's just messing with our heads. You're probably right. Still, I'd like to hear what the captain has to say about all this. Is it being a specter a good thing, though? Isn't that a higher rank? Wait, hang on. Can I find this out? Humanity's first contact. The system's alliance. Is, is there a way I can find this out? Because I, I think I'm getting confused here. Um. Citadel. The Citadel is an ancient deep. The Council no. is an executive committee composed of specters. Are agents from the Office of Special oh, Tactics and Reconnaissance and answer only to the Citadel Council. They They're are elite, elite military, military operatives, operatives granted, granted the authority, the authority to deal, deal with, with threats, threats to, to peace and stability in whatever way they deem necessary. They operate, they operate independently. independently or in groups of two or three. Some are empathetic peacekeepers, resolving disputes through diplomacy. Others are cold-blooded assassins, ruthlessly dispatching problem individuals. All okay. get the job done one way or another often operating outside the bounds of galactic law. The Spectres oh. were founded after the Salarians joined the Council. For many years, they operated in secrecy as backroom problem solvers. Like spies. Only after the Krogan rebellions did their activities become publicized. Assignment of a Spectre is less contentious than a military deployment, but makes it clear that the Council is concerned about a situation. Okay. Okay. Well, I don't think that's a bad thing. Why is that a bad thing that he was a spectre? Why did Ashley freak out like that? Ashley, I think you need to calm down a second. Okay, I don't think it's that bad. I think that's actually good. That's actually good for him. Okay. Right. Journal. We've done that. Oh, yeah. Where is that? Hang on. We were finding Garrus as well. He's in. He is in. Med clinic in the upper wards. Where? Where are the upper wards? Hey, so where are they gonna be? Oh wow, look at all these plate look at all these people. Hello, Hello Morland. there. Welcome to Morland's famous shop. Hey. You want many good supplies, yes? Oh he's cute! Let me see what you have. Oh, you will be pleased, I think. Very good things I have. You will see. Aw. Let me view the armors. Now why did it say non human? Or Turian? Krogan. What does that mean? Does that mean, does that mean we're going to eventually get a Turian on our team? Many good supplies, yes. Any supplies? Oh, you will be pleased. Standard I think. items. Very good see. things I have. You will see. Oh, he is so cute, Oh, Morlan. Absolute cutie. We've only got three hundred smackaroos. Whoa! Sixty-two thousand buckaroos. Are you joking me? 
Oh, whoa, whoa. Elena's risk control license for Normandy Quartermaster. Unique item. Hey, that seems like something I might need. Should I buy that? That seems like something I'm going to need eventually. Hey, I'm buying it. I bought it! Guys, I'm reckless with my money here. <laughs> I'm just buying everything. Don't know if I need it, but I'm buying it. But I'm buying it. I feel like that I'm going to need that later on. It seems like a, a story thing. I'm buying it anyway. Okay, door control, get me out of here. Let me through here, seriously, dude. Now, can I travel? Actually, hang on. Exit, let me check my map in case I have to go somewhere else here. This office, lower markets. Okay, we've been there, we've been there, we've been there. No. Okay, so I'm going to travel and I'm going to go back to over here. Is someone in the... Uh, let me go back to the tower. Because I, I think, right, we have to unlock all these places by walking to them, so... Let's check our map again. Oh, I went to the wrong place. I went to the wrong place. Hey, I went to the wrong place. Get me back on here. Yes. That's locations. Embassies. Let's go to here. Let's go to here and then we can walk around. Yes, here we go. Right, map. C-Sec. Didn't we need that for something? Journal. Uh, med clinic, upper wards. We need upper wards. We need upper wards and we need C-Sec Academy. Right? C-Sec Academy, where is that? Embassy Lounge. Do you think it's in here somewhere? Uh, if I zoom in, I can't see anything. Maybe I will... Ch maybe... Maybe I will go there, and then we'll see... Oh! Oh! Seasick Academy! This way. Going this way! That's where we have to go, Seasick Academy. What's this way? Seasick Academy, going this way. Seasick Academy is this way, gang. To CSEC Academy. Is this it here? Get yeah, elevator leaves down to CSEC Academy. Yes, here we go, gang! Okay, doing it, doing it, doing it. This is gaming, dude! Are my girlies with me? Where's Kaiden? In light of the recent oh, attack on you can just do it. Crime, many colonial you can just investors do it. are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. <laughs> Many colonial proposals are on hold until backers have some reassurance that human colonies will be adequately protected. We get out of the news here. Oh my god, the elevator music! That's so cute! Hi, hey, everyone! Hi, so the party's arrived. Hey! Rex, here we go. Yes! Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. This Low is your voice. only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Hee <laughs> Rex is violent. Oh, Rex is like a giant tortoise, so I actually Go enjoy on. him a lot. Get out of here. Yes, human. We need to talk. I'm trying to bring down Saren. Barla Vaughn said to talk to you. Barla Vaughn is a wise man. We may share a common goal, human. How so? Enlighten me. I've been hired to kill the owner of Korra's den. Okay. A man named Fist. He did something very foolish. Let me guess. He betrayed the Shadow Broker. A Quarian showed up here on the Citadel. She was on the run. She wanted to trade information for a safe place to hide, so she went to Fist. He promised to arrange a meeting between her and the Shadow Broker. Instead, he contacted Saren. Why? What does Saren have to do with this? Well, the Corian has something that connects Saren to the Geth. He paid Fist a small fortune for her. If we get our hands on that evidence, we can prove that Saren's a traitor. 
and the council will have to listen to us. Kaiden is so smart, gang. He's really just in the back putting all the pieces together. I have to find her. Where's the Quarian now? Last I heard, Fist still had her. Probably somewhere inside his club. You help me kill Fist, she's all yours. It's a deal. Oh my god, are we making a deal with- are we making a deal? Time we paid Fist a visit. Yeah. What about Garrus, that Turian? He wants to take Saren down too. We could use him. He might come in handy. He was here just before you showed up. Said he was going to follow up a lead on his investigation. Wanted to speak to the doctor at the med clinic. We already know that info. Move out. Oh my god, shut the front door. Gang, we have Rex on our team. Ha! Add to squad! Add to squad! Oh, I can only have two? Damn it. Actually, I'm keeping Kaiden, sorry. Yes! <laughs> Guys, look at my mates! Oh, don't mess with me, will you please? Guys, sitting Ashley out for a minute because Kaiden's doing a lot of work here doing all the puzzles for me. Ashley's just making some comments here and there, and I need Rex to fight okay, Fist. Julie. So, let me, get this straight. Let me just keep him here sure. for a minute. You Hang on, there was a guy down here. Well, no. Uh, Hello! Not... Hey there! Hi! Oh, you're not CSEC, are you? Did you want something? I overheard you. What were you trying to explain to the officer before? My colleague is trying to kill me. Oh. And I thought we were friends. Yeah, that's a HR issue, that one. That's gonna be a HR issue. That's that's a serious claim. How do you know he wants you dead? He's changed. He won't talk to me at work anymore, and he started following me. <laughs> that means he wants to kill you. Yesterday, he followed me all the way home, just waiting for a chance. Maybe he fancies you. I don't care what anyone thinks. He wants me gone. I know it. What do you need? Is there something I can do? Uh, talk to your friend, maybe? Would you? That's all I want. Someone to talk to him. Tell him to leave me alone. I think he, I think he likes you. Here's the thing. He thinks he can just push me around. But you'll show him, won't you? I'll talk to him. Just tell me where he is and I'll go find him. Oh, we, we shouldn't have done that. Oh, right. Oh, well, he wanted to meet with me down in the wards near the markets. He said he just wanted to talk, but I know better. His name's Shorban. He's a Salarian. Shorban? You shouldn't have any trouble. He's just a scientist. Well, good luck. Thank you, Jarlid. Oh, thank you so much, you sweetie. Okay. Guys, I will help some of the civilians here, okay? I'm not going to be that reckless. And that's going to be that much of a savage dude, seriously. Okay. What is a tracking terminal? Examine! Let's get that in the codex. Another one. And another one. Yes, get me these points, will you? What do these points do, gang? Can someone let me know? What do, when I get these codex points, what does that mean? Oh my god, Rex. Every time I visit the Citadel, c -Sec brings me here. <laughs> I'm guessing c -Sec's like the little chat. The, the police or something. Weapons locker! What's that? Okay, can't go there. Okay, let me check my map. Don't need to be here. We do not need to be here. Let's go back. Let's go and find a point and get out of here. And then when we do that, we need to go to the medical ward, okay? Everyone, we need to go to the medical ward. Uh, how do I get out of here? Hey! Hey, so how do I get out of here? Here. Right here, dude. Literally, right here, okay? Okay, travel. Presidium. I'll go back to the embassies. Just because this is like the main, this, the, the middle bit. And then we'll check the map again. Okay. Now we need to go to... Wait, journal? Okay, that's not, that's not urgent right now. How do I get to my missions? Here we go. Garrus, go to the med clinic. Upper wards. Where on earth are the upper wards? They're not here. Could they be in the consort chambers? Potentially. Right? Maybe? Let's go here, because they might be there. Let's go this way. 
Because if the upper wards could be in the upper bit, right? The upper chambers. But that wasn't a hospital. Was there anything that said hospital? Oh, gang, this might be wrong. This may be wrong, dude. But I'm going in anyway. To CSEC and embassies. Mm, I don't know if this is right. I've had my office rearranged five times in uh, what is in here? Ooh, who are you? Welcome, I am Nelina. Hello! I don't recognize you as one of our expected clients today. Would These you guys like are so cute! Would you see when the consort will be able to meet with you? I need an appointment. Can't I just go in? I don't know what this mm, is. I'm afraid not. Yeah, you must understand there are many who seek the consort services. But if you wish to leave your name, she'll make every effort to meet with you. Alright. Commander Shepard. I don't know what I'm doing. Alliance Navy. Excellent. You should hear something in... Um... Three or four months. Are you serious? Nobody's worth that much of a wait. <laughs> well, that's not for me to judge. I have your name and you'll be contacted. Is there anything else? Investigate. Personal question. What do you do here, Nalina? I'm one of the consort's acolytes. Many of the people here today will not see the consort, but they expect to be attended to just the same. It's our job to ensure that they leave contented. How? What exactly do you attend to? Well, each acolyte has her unique abilities. Some soothe with song, others with conversation. As much as possible, we seek to match the needs of our clients to the skills of our acolytes. My specialty is touch. My fingertips can find every tension point in your body and relieve it. Sounds interesting. I'd like to try out your services. Excellent. I'll add you to our client list. We should be able to see you in... Mm, three or four months. Okay, goodbye. I think I'm done here. Oh, well, I hope you'll return again in the future. I've got no idea you what this place is. always enjoy seeing new clients. Okay, sweetie. Nalina. Yes, Shaira? Send the commander up to see me. I wish to speak with her. Yes, of course, mistress. Guys, what have I just signed up to? Don't stroke the wall like that. No need for that. No, there's no need for that. Huh. It appears the consort has taken notice of you. She'd like to meet with you now. Why? What does she want to see me for? I don't know. You'll have to ask her yourself. Just head upstairs. She'll be waiting for you. Um... Okay. Yeah. No, this seems fine. Hey, this seems fine. Hello! You're with the Alliance? My brother's a private back on Earth. Oh, brilliant. Thank you for sharing that. Yeah, no, this seems fine. Hey, going up here, gang. This was the right way, wasn't it? Here she is. Hey! Shaira. That is close enough, Command. I've heard a great many things about you since your arrival here in our Citadel. You're checking up on me. I don't like people spying on me. Tell them! I apologize, Commander. I make it my business to know when important people arrive on the station. Many of them become clients. But that is not why I asked you here. Oh, what I have happened? a certain problem that could use your expertise. Tell me about it. Maybe I can help. I have a friend, Septimus, a retired Turian general. I won't discuss the details, but he wanted me to be more than I could be. We had a falling out. Now he spends his days in Cora's den, drinking and spreading lies about me. You might have seen him. If you would speak to him as a fellow soldier, I believe he will listen to you and let the matter be. What went wrong? What happened between you? I respect his privacy too much to go into the details. If he wishes to tell you what happened, that is his prerogative. Not interested. Why should I bother to help your friend? Could it be I was wrong about you, Commander? Are you certain you will not aid me in this? That right. Okay. What exactly do you want me to tell him? Appeal to a sense of honor. Remind him of his position as a general. If you can convince him to stop spreading Whoa. lies about me, I would be very grateful. What's happening? Get out of my space, dude. Seriously. Jeebers. Now I must ask you to take your leave. I have many clients waiting to see me. Dude, I don't like. Don't get all up in my grill like that. What is that? What on earth was that, dude? What on earth was that? So weird. That was so weird. A gang. That was weird and unnecessary. <laughs> there was no need for that. There was no need. Oh, there was no need. I have to admit, I'm a little nervous. 
Why are you nervous? Guys, this place is weird. It's given me the it's given me the weirdies. It's given me the weirdies, and I'm thinking I I I think I should not have wandered into there. Okay, that was so off. That was so not what I was supposed to be doing. I'm looking for the med ward actually. <laughs> Just, where is that? Hey. Oh, we have to go back into. We have to go back into Cora's den. Oh, that's at the lower wards. We need to be in the upper wards. Oh, hang on. Where was that? Where were we? We were just there. Where on earth were we? We just saw Cora's den. That was in the lower wards. Oh, actually, that just helped me. Wards. Oh, med clinic. Cora's den. Let's go there. I'm confused. Okay, let's go back in here. Hey! Hey, everyone. Hey, we're back in here. We got some business to attend to, okay? Nothing major, just a little bit. Just gotta speak to someone. Looks like it shut down. Why? This knows what Oh! Okay! Wow, they really take some bullets. How are you gonna ta how is a human gonna take four shotgun hits? That's insane. That's insane! Yeah. How do you duck? Get down here. Yes, yes. Switching out, switching out, and I want my assault rifle, and I want my assault rifle, and here we go, and it's a three, two, one. Head to the face gets wrecked with you. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, it's still alive. Yes. Yes. Bam. I'm big fat shooting your head, so why are you not dying with immediate effect? I don't want to video to fuck. Hey! Kaiden, you best be healing, my boy. You best be healing, my boy. Excellent work, gang. Just absolutely fantastic. What's that? Can we shoot that? Everyone back up. Seriously, come here. I need to shoot this a second. I need to know. No! Go there. Yeah. And Rex, come out, because I'm going to fire this. Right. Okay. I just wanted to know, because I saw that on the prologue, and I never shot it, and I was curious. Now I know, dude. Hello? Stop oh, right you... there. Don't come... Yes! Yes! Come on! Come on, you loser! Let's go! Guess what? Meleeing. Lost shield. <laughs> Do my shields regenerate? Oh, is that what the red thing is? Oh, though it's the blue thing. Okay. Oh, you regen he health as well? Question mark. Hey. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh my god, I'm dying. Oh my god, I'm dying. Duck, will you? Oh. Okay, I need to learn how to resume. I need to learn how to use the controls on here. I gotta learn how to use the controls, dude. He said there's an auto save. Okay, chorus then. Yes, we're going back in here. Oh my god, could you imagine if it didn't save the whole game? That would have been just terrible because I've not saved this whole time. But let me just do that right now. Save. Yes. Okay, going in. Looks like it shut down. No, it's not, dude. Nose I smell here we go. Here we go. And he's down. And he's down. Okay, switching out to this. Switching out to this. And we're going in. Now, let me check my equipment real quick, because... Have I got the right stuff here? Let me just check. Shotgun. 
Sniper. Yes, I think I've got everything that I need. Not much stuff can go higher. Damn. That's got less... Oh, okay, yeah. Fine, we'll stick to what we've got. Can I change armor or anything? Oh, armor. Anything else I can have here. Light armor, light armor. Because I want to... How do I level up and stuff, do you know? I want to check I'm doing things right. Not sure. Okay, we're just going to keep going. We're just going to keep going, gang! Can I shoot through there? I don't think so. Let's go! Let's go! Get down! Oh my god! Oh my god! Get, get wrecked. Whoa! Yes. Yes! How do you throw grenades? I don't know how you throw grenades. Switching. Yes. Yes. Yes! Okay, gang. I don't know how you throw a grenade. No idea how you do that. Crystal here! Or through here? Hey! Oh, oh, oh! Wait, let me shoot the fire thing. Oh, it did nothing! Yeah, the accuracy is not good on this thing. That's okay, though. Okay, going through here. You! Stop right there. Don't Die! Die! You! I'm here. Yes! Oh, get wrecked, will you? Oh, we can do one of these again. Yes. Yes. Oh my god, take all, will you? Only one of them here? Very good. Alright, let's keep going, gang. Pushing forward. Whoa! Yep. Whoa, what's happening? Whoa, what's happening? I'm dying! Oh, they're turrets? Am I out of ammo or something? Why can't I shoot? Whoa! Overheated. Wait! Don't kill me, I surrender! Start talking. Tell me where the Quarian is and I won't have to shoot you in the kneecaps. She's not here, I don't know where she is, that's the truth. He's no use to you now. Let me kill him. Wait, wait, I don't know where the Quarian is, but I know where you can find her. The Quarian isn't here, said she'd only deal with the Shadow Broker himself. Mm. Face to face? Impossible. Even I was hired through an agent. Nobody meets the Shadow Broker, ever. He seems nice. Even I don't know his true identity. But she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. <gasps> you! Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. Okay. You can okay. make it if you hurry. Hey gang, going there swiftly. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> the shadow broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. He deserved it. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. Yep. Now let's move. He we tried have to kill to us. Save that quarian. Get to the quarian and warn her before it's too late. But not before I decrypt this. Will you please hold? Speed run! Taking all! Okay! Uh, uh, how do we go? How do we get out of here? What was that? Take. I just took a. Oh, 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 oh! Hang on, we're timed! <laughs> oh my god, we're timed! Oh my god! Come on, gang! Seriously! Come on! Oh my god, we're timed! We're timed, gang. Seriously. Come on. 
Let's go, let's go. Seriously, I will melee you if I have to. I'm going to die. Did you get him? Wait, hang on. Sorry, I just nearly died. Please hold. That was foolish of me. I accidentally meleeed the, uh... Oh, wait. Where is she? What's this exclamation mark? I don't know where I'm going! This way! Why is there an exclamation mark over here? What's that? Why is there an exclamation mark here? Hey! Is there something here I'm missing? Oh my god, I don't know. Quick, just go. I just lost 20 seconds. Why was there an exclamation mark there? What does it mean? I don't know. I have no idea. I'm moving this way. Quick, quick, quick. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. To lower markets. Yes. Let me in. Store leads to lower markets. Continue through the upper markets and beyond to find the present. Yes. Get me in. Why can't I get in? Hello? Oh my god, why can't I get in? I can't get in there. Am I supposed to do something? Oh no, have I missed something, gang? I think I missed something. Oh, that's in there. Oh, it's here. Bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Yes. These are Saren's men. Oh my god, she grenaded him. Get wrecked, you absolute losers! Get wrecked, you got grenaded! <laughs> yes! Oh my god! Oh my god, he Uno reversed me! What's happening? I got Uno reversed! Why are you over here? Need some help here. I, I couldn't shoot! Wait, I couldn't shoot! Well, it wouldn't let me shoot. Why? Damn, we have to do all this again. And I have to do this again! Yo. Bam, bam, bam! Yes. Take it all. Take it all. The winner takes it all! Okay, moving out here. Let's go, seriously, dude. Why are you hurting? Just had a good thing going here. Too bad yes, that is a shame. Very sad. Yes, very sad. Yes, thoughts and prayers. Okay, here we go, gang. Whoa. 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 Okay, moving out. Oh my god. Oh my god. Die, 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 die. Die, die, die. Got him. Shooting that. Let's go through here. Heading out. Guys, we're speedrunning now. This is a big fat speedrun, seriously. Okay, come on. Don't need the way to Cora's Den. We need to go out to the markets, but we can't get there. Okay, opening this. Open! Yes, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go, dude. Let's go. Do, do, do. Here we go. Let's go. I tried to Did shoot you them. Bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's, the deal's off. off. Let's go, gamers. Are you ready? Here we go. Here we go. One. This is the guy who killed me last time, so let's get him. Okay, we did Just it. set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Are you okay? Were you hurt in the fight? I know how to look after myself. Not that I don't appreciate the help. She's cute! Who are you? Someone who saved your life. I don't have time for questions. I need the evidence you have against Saren. I guess I owe you. You do owe me, sweetie. But not out here in the open. We need to go somewhere safe. <laughs> yes! The ambassador's office. It's safe there. He'll want to see this anyway. Yes, gang! Let's go, Gamer! You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's Den. Do you know how many... 
Who's this? The hey. Quarian? Hey. What are you up to, Shepard? I don't want to tell him to shut up because he's nice. Chicken elbows. Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, Miss. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. She's cool. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage, my rite of passage into adulthood. Get to the point, Where's dude. the proof you promised? Ugh. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Vale. I was curious. Hmm. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. Okay. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. But true. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Okay. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Oh wow, look at this. Look at her technology, Eden dude. Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. What's the conduit? He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? What does that mean? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Mm. If this is Nihilus... Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. Not Nihilus. I don't recognize that other voice, the one talking about Reapers. Reaper sounds familiar. I feel like I've heard that name before. According to the Memory Corps, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. It's not far-fetched, dude. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, oh. the pinnacle of non-organic life, and they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. Ooh, they need to know or don't tell them. I think don't tell them. Let's just wait till we've got some more evidence. They won't believe you anyway. Just keep them out of this. We have to tell them. Even if they don't believe anything else, this proves Saren is a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. Well, don't- well, Ugh. Don't ask me then. My name is Tali. It's Tali, you idiot. Right? You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. What about your quest? I thought you were on your pilgrimage. The pilgrimage proves we are willing to give of ourselves for the greater good. What does it say about me if I turn she can my join back us? on this? Saren is a danger to the entire galaxy. My pilgrimage can wait. You could be useful. I'll take all the help I can get. Yay! Thanks. You won't regret this. Guys, we got Anderson Tally. And I will go ahead to get things ready with the council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Oh my god, guys, look at my girlies. Are you serious? Add to squad. Ooh. Ooh, Ash is good at combat. But he adds a bit of everything. I'm gonna stick with these two. Oh, damn. Oh my god, look at my girlies, seriously. Very cool. Oh, okay. Begin override. Oh wow, this is a this is an advanced one. Yes! That was a speed run! Okay, Alliance Patrol report. Captain Hendrickson reported some unusual energy readings during a patrol of the Argos Row Cluster. She had particular concerns about the Hydra system, but was recalled before her team could investigate further. No patrols are scheduled for that sector. Do you- do we want to send in the recon team? Interesting. 
Interesting. So much empty space. Yes. A thousand of my people could live here and hardly even see each other. Oh. She's so cute. I like her a lot. Okay, journal. What do we got to do next? While on the Citadel, you uncovered an Alliance patrol report. One of the patrols mentioned some strange activity in the Hydro system of the Argos Row Cluster. Where is the Hydro system? We have to do a bit more in here. The general's at... Core... Oh, yeah, should we do this? Should we go and do this? Wait, where is Cora's den? It's just in here, isn't it? Is this where we just were? Damn. Where is the, uh... Let me get up the stairs. Let me get up the stairs. Whoa! What you're saying, but these allegate, please Hello. Reading. Human, it is always good to see your kind. Kal Kalin. I am Ambassador Kalin. Kalin. Query. Is there something I can do for you this day? Oh my God! Don't sound too happy, will you? Your speech. Why do you explain what you're about to say? Our people communicate less through words and more through scent and slight movements. Well, that makes sense. Plainly, we discovered our vocal expression was not enough to convey the feelings of our conversations to other species. That is coming through. Why yes. do you bother, Kaelin? These Earth Clan don't really care about our ways. Hey, shut your Remorseful face. Remorseful response, Din. You don't truly believe that. And if you do, I am very sorry for you. Investigate, Ambassador. What do you do here? Modestly. I work to bring the problems and the requests of the Elcor groups to the attention of the Council. Ha! They only give us these positions to keep us quiet. The Council doesn't care about our races. Din is miserable. rebuke. Your tone is inappropriate, Din. Yes, Din, be quiet. This human is not to blame for your malcontent or your misconceived suspicions. Who's Elko? Tell me more about your species. Oh, their species. Genuine enthusiasm. I delight in telling the history of my people. <laughs> it is agreeable to share our culture with others. Culture, please! I'd like to know more about the culture of the Elkor. Frankly, we Elcor prefer the safety and familiarity of our own colonies to the confines of space travel. Our society is built on small, tight-knit groups, though we are always welcoming to outsiders. Actually, our government he's so tends sweet. to be very stable. Our people are not very comfortable with sudden changes. That's understandable. Goodbye, Ambassador. Sincere farewell. Aww. Good day to you, human. Hello there, human. Sincere apology, but I am here on business and cannot be distracted right now. What's wrong? You seem distressed. Is there something I can do to help? Alarmed response. You overheard that, did you? Oh. This is all going so wrong, and it is the Asari consort's fault. She's the one who started all What this. does she do? Who's this Asari consort? Curious. You have not <gasps> heard. We just met you her. must be new to the Citadel. Everyone knows Shaira, the yes. consort. Yes, Shakira. It's coming back to me. I cannot speak more about this problem. It is too sensitive. Suffice it to say, she has compromised my authority as a diplomat. Where is she? Where can I find the Sasari consort? We already spoke to her. She is across the bridge from here. Her offices are easy enough to spot. Good day, human. Zelton is very sad because of consort. Right. Is she dodgy? But now she wants us to go and she wants to go, us to go to uh Cora's den. Cora's den? Oh lord, I forgot the name of it. Cora's den, right? Hey, where is that? Oh guys, I lost where it was. Okay, we need to we need to get out of here. We need to get out of here. I'm stuck. I feel trapped. I feel trapped and I don't know how to get out of here. Hey, please let me out of here. Oh my god. So hey! So how do I get out of here? I don't want to talk to Din, he's miserable. He's a miserable sod and I don't want to talk to him. Oh my god, oh. How do I get out of here? Hey! Oh, I feel trapped. Oh, I'm trapped. Oh, I'm trapped. 
Here? Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, here we go. Oh, hello, Excuse a human. Me, Commander Shepard. Good. Commander Shepard. Hello. My name is Samesh Bhatia. Forgive the intrusion, but I have nowhere else to turn. What is it, dude? A lot of people want my help these days. They do, they really do. you special? My wife was a Marine. She was in the 212 on Eden Prime. I've requested that my wife's body be returned to me for cremation, Aww. but the military has refused my request. That's garbage. Why did they refuse your request? There's got to be some reason. I don't know. All I know is that they have declared it impossible for my wife to be returned to me. We'll put this right. There's no reason for your wife's body to be held like this. Just wait here. The man in charge of my case is Mr. Bosker. When I last saw him, he was in the expensive bar over there. Thank you for your time. I just want to give my wife a proper funeral and the respect she deserves. That's lovely. Hey, and guess what, Samesh? You're gonna get that. Hey, you're gonna get that. Good day, hey. Commander. The human ambassador is up the stairs, first room on the right. No. I should be going now. Have a no. pleasant day. No, no. I don't have time for this. I don't have time for this. What I need to do is go to... Yes. Yes, this is what I need to go. I want to go on a rapid transport. Let me go on rapid transport, and I want to go to... No. Ward locations. Where's the den? Can't I go straight there? Yes! Cora's den. Here we go, dude! Heading there. Wait, do I have two things to do in here now? Excellent work. Brilliant. Is it in here? No. Morlin. Uh, no. You're not what I need. What's all this down here? Oh, the fire containment system. Okay. No, no, no. We have to be behind. This was the second part, I remember. There's two parts to Cora's Den. Yes, here we go. Here we go, gang. This is the way. This is the way. In here. Whoa, look at that sign. Hey, everyone. <gasps> Patty. Hey, girl, you want to say something? Dancers are highly respected among my people, but I get the feeling these women are not held in high esteem. Yes. Yes, that is unfortunate. Are you the guy? I got business here, no. but not with you. Septimus. Commander. <laughs> what do you want? Problems? What's bothering you, General? I've seen a lot of horrible things in my days, and... There's only one woman in this damn galaxy that helps me forget. Shaira. This is the great Turian general. How did your kind ever defeat us? I may be drunk, Krogan, but you're ugly. Tomorrow <laughs> I'll be sober. Unless wow. you have a cure for this ache in my gut. Go away. Septimus Prime here is savage. Uh, you're pathetic. Some general. What kind of example are you to your troops? Oh, that was the bit harsh. The troops can kiss my leathery backside. That's fair. All I wanted was to retire. Oh, he's in love. Her. He's in Look, love. Kid, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but don't waste your time. I can't do any of this. I'm not leaving. You need to start acting like a general if you want to beat this. Yes. I spent all my life acting like a general, and what did it get me? Huh? No. Those days are over. I'll just be oh. what I am. A tired, lonely, worn-out soldier. He's very handsome. I don't know why she doesn't want him. Uh, don't give up. Do you really want to be remembered this way? That's what I'm no, saying. No, I'd rather not be remembered at all. <laughs> but I see your point. So you think it's that easy? Just straighten up and act like a general? Yes, dude. It's better than sitting on your ass all day. Tell him, Rex. Tell him. Huh. Maybe you're right, Commander. Shaira's worth the effort. Even if she won't have me back. Finally. Now get up and get moving, General. All right. I'll go to her. After I've had a cold shower or two. Say, you're a bright kid. Would you be interested in earning a few extra credits? I don't want to say no thanks because I feel like I'm shooting opportunities down here. <sighs> sure. What do you want me to do? There's an Elcor diplomat out there who believes
believe Shaira gave up his secrets. Why would he think such a thing? Because I told him. <laughs> Look, I just need you to convince him of the truth. You do it. Why can't you tell him yourself? Well, the last time he saw me, I I was disparaging his ancestors. That's Miss Prime, you idiot. My secrets in public. Take this data pad. It shows where I got my info. It will exonerate Shaira and convince the Elcor. Oh, this is the one we just spoke to. Where oh, is he? And where is he? His name is Zelta. Yeah, this He's is the one we just spoke to. He's over in the embassies complaining about Shaira. Oh. Well, here's to soldiers acting like soldiers. Cheers, darling. Cheers, darling. You know. You might make a good general yourself one day. Oh, I know. Oh, I know it's sunshine. Hey. Hey, and that's on that. And was there someone else we had to speak to in here? Um, here. Chorben. Oh, he's in the lower markets. I thought Chorben was in... I recognise Chorben. Speak with Shahira, I have to go back there. Then come and talk with the diplomat. And speak to Bosca. He's in the embassy lounge. Oh, oh my lord, there's so many places we have to go. Okay. This is an opening. Oh, it is. Just kidding. Hey, that's actually going to be opening. Oh, we've been here. We've been here. Ooh. I found something. Cake. Ooh, an area map. Did we get any map? Lower markets. Damn. Okay, we have to go back out. We have to go back out, dude. Cutting out. Yes, get me back out of here. Get me out of here. And then we have to go into... Yes! Okay, dead sirs, let's go. Yeah. <laughs> the music still sounds like it's in another room, but it's not. That just tripped out for a second. That just tripped out for a real quick second there. Is that a road? Whoa, look at the people zooming on that. Oh my god, please say there's racing in this. Okay, going out. Lower markets. Yes, this is where we have to go. Let me out. Chorburn, here we go. Hold it right there. Just oh, throw me the data and you can walk away. Back down. Literally back down. Drop your weapons. Now. I don't think so, human. I'll ask you one was more. Was this the guy I said was nice? Give me the data, and you and Jalid will live to see another day. Of my dead body. Come and get it, Solarian. It'll be the last mistake uh -huh. you make. Fine. Have it your way, boys. Oh, you have backup. Oh, fine. Three on three. Easy. Let's dance. Let's dance. Let's dance. I give up. I give up. Please don't kill me. Convince me. What's so important about this data? Why are you trying to get it? Well, I thought you knew. He said you were going to deliver it. He said that. And what exactly was I supposed to be delivering? It's the initial data from scanning the keepers. You see, we stole some research from our work to make the scanners. We were supposed to work together. I get the data, he analyzes it. That's it? That's what all the fuss is about? The keepers are almost impossible to scan. And you can't capture them or get samples. They just self-destruct. After centuries here, we still don't know anything about them. Don't you see? We were the first to scan them, ever. And Jalid? Why are you trying to kill your partner? I'm not trying to kill him. Jalid's job was to disseminate our initial findings. But he decided to keep the data for himself. Maybe to sell it. Uh. I don't know. Uh, I should kill both of you idiots. Yes, we should. We lost our heads. We just couldn't let an opportunity like this pass us by. But it doesn't matter now. Torben! I just want to live. I don't care if I ever see that data again. Scanning. So how do you gather data on the keepers? It's not difficult, really. Just get within range and scan them. You seem interested. Enough to help me, perhaps? No. I suggest you stick to research and leave the espionage to the rest of us. <laughs> well, I won't. Or I, I will. Stick to research, that is. Thank you. Goodbye. Goodbye, dude. What do we do about the lying Volus? 
I'm gonna kill him. I'm gonna show him what happens to people who lie to me. Yes! Come on, Jane! Jane, that's what I'm talking about, okay? That's what I'm talking about. Okay, let me check my journal real quick. Jaheed. Jaleed. Sorry, Jaleed. Right. CSEC Academy. Guess what? Heading there swiftly. CSEC Academy, and I'm heading there swiftly. Hey! He's here, right? Yeah. CSEC Academy's here. It's near here, I know it is. Oh, gang. Oh, you losers. I'm gonna get him now. Seasick Academy, where is it? Seasick Academy this way, it's downstairs. Heading there swiftly. Guess what? Guess what, Jellied? Wait, Jellied was the human who lied about the wife, right? This is the one who wanted his wife saved. Oof, r rough day for him. Hey, sorry about that, gang. A Solarian okay. excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site. Press H skip. Skipping! Oh, we still have to wait to go down. I thought it would skip this. I thought this was just a scene. Okay, here we go. Where is he? Where are you? Where are you now? Map. Here he is. Heading there swiftly. Right, where are you? This way. You're this way, dude. Guess what, Jaleed? Feel my wrath. Hey, guess what, sir? Feel my wrath, will you? Hey. So, hey, everyone. Oh, no, Jaleed's the little dude. I remember, yes, okay. Hello it again. wasn't the man. Did you have any luck finding Shorbin? Of course. I found out you've been lying to me, Jaleed. Lying? Why would I lie to you? You lied to us about the Keeper data. Uh, he told you? I didn't mean for any of this to happen. Well, well. I was afraid Shorbin would kill me to get the data, so I... Well, I was hoping you'd take care of him. This is serious, Jaleed. You could spend the rest of your life locked up. But I can't. What will happen to the data when I'm gone? Who will carry on our research? <sighs> We're not going to kill him, Too are late, we? Polis. You had your chance. But this data could be used to unravel all the secrets of the Keepers. Think what we could learn about the Citadel. Go on, tell me more about oh, this data. Oh, we're not gonna kill him. Well, it's still very preliminary, but our initial scan suggests the Keepers are as old as the Citadel itself. We might learn how the Citadel was built, or why the Keepers always rearrange things. The possibilities are limitless. I don't have any options. Too bad. I can't let your actions go unpunished. No, please. I'll do anything. I've got credits. Let me go and you can have them. All of them. What credits? What's going on over here? Oh, Is this Volus causing you some trouble, Commander? We're fine. Everything's okay, officer. Thanks for asking. Get out of here, seriously. Get out of here. If you say so. I'll be right over here if you change your mind. Brilliant. Hey, mind your own. Do you know what I mean? Thank you. That was too close. Payment. Now you can return the favor by filling up my bank account. Thank you! Oh, right. There you go. That's just about everything I've got. What was it, 50 quid? Thank you for not turning me in. I'll make the most of this second chance, I promise you. Whatever. Just go. Um, Commander? Would you be interested in helping me study the Keepers? No. I don't have time for this. Well, I thought I'd ask. <laughs> so long. Bye! We've got 170 quid, is that it? 120 smackaroons, is that it? Take all. Okay, what have we got here? Anything new I can upgrade me with? No, dude, this place sucks. Oh, oh, that has tech protection, though. Ooh, ooh! Oh, I can't even equip it. Damn it! I can't even equip it, dude! Why? Is there something I'm not doing? Is there something I'm missing? Oh, there's lots to do here, gang. There's lots to do. But I think that is where I'm going to end for today.
All right, gang, that is where I'm going to stop for today. I can't quite tell if I'm doing main missions or side missions at the moment. There seems to be a lot of things happening in one place, a lot of things linking to each other. It's very interesting. I'm really enjoying it, but it's not a level-based game like I thought it was. I, I thought it was like Halo where you go in and you do one level and you come out, but that's not the case at all. So I'm conscious not to try and miss anything, but at the same time, keep the game moving forward for you guys to watch as well. I don't want to stay in one spot for too long. But other than that, I'm having a great time. You met two new girlies today. We've got two new friends on the team. We've got Rex and Tali, and she is an absolute cutie. I'm so glad we met her. It's, it's actually interesting as well because we could have chose to not have her on the team. So I'm going and I guess we're going to meet more characters and we can choose whether they're on the team or not. I hope that my team have been leveling up in the background as well. I haven't quite managed to keep a tab on that. So hopefully they have. I need to work out how I can level up as well. So I'm going to have to take some time to just go through that off camera, I think, just to get to grips with it a little bit more. But I'm really, really enjoying the game. There's lots of characters that interlink with each other. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. That would mean the world to me. I can't believe we're over 1,500 subscribers now. That's insane. Thank you so, so much. I really, really hope you guys are enjoying the video still. That is where I'm going to leave it for today. So I will see you, Commanders, in the next one. Goodbye!